Richard, congratulations. You are now MP for Isle of Wight West. Yeah. Labour have been trying consistently for 100 years to get a seat on the Isle of Wight. Yeah. You're the man that's managed it. How does that feel? It's good. I mean, you don't think about these things at the time. You just think about what the job is, and that's why I'm desperate to get on with it, get, get on with the job. Uh, but yeah, it's great. I mean, uh, hopefully it sets a sign for people that felt disenfranchised with politics that anything's possible. And it's been a long five years. We've been doing this for five years, and we've got a great team. We ran a positive campaign, which was a lot of fun. Uh, but yeah, it's, it's great. And your first 100 days, what does that look like? Well, we spoke before, and as I've said, the top three problems, ferries is all four of them. Uh, but first thing is getting the Isle of Wight back on the map. We've been, you know, we've been invisible for the last 10 years. Everybody knows that. Uh, we've got now twice as much representation, whoever it is wins it on the east. Uh, and then we've got the plan we've been putting together the last 18 months. So ferries, education, housing and schooling. And that's where we'll be.